Hey guys, Noise here with another daily recap. So it's a green day today, it's first day, um, it's Monday. I did not trade last Friday as I went out. I'm not sure if I mentioned it on the on the Thursday daily recap. But yeah, today the market is pretty quiet, I would say. But ATR made a decent move. So yeah, in the pre-market, um added here for it to break, as you can see. Let me show you on it should be this. There was a downtrend. Yeah, so there was this downtrend. Uh nothing too strong. It's just a pre-market downtrend. So I added here. Just for it to go up. So I sold half at the view up in case it decides to fail the view up and get knife flash down. Then hold the remaining small pop I sold here thinking it could be like it went up and flush in the open so I got out here to be safe however in the open it went up instead and I'm okay with it just to play it safe I, I got out here I I mean in hindsight it went up to 15 sounds like um, I'm losing a big pile of money on the table but I'm okay with it because it could go both ways like it went up and so it came down so it could it could be the same thing so I'm okay leaving here besides this I was in like 1370 or something I got it I wrote it for 60 cent 65 cent so I'm okay with it then went up came down so at here I was thinking maybe uh I think this was almost a three bar play so at that time so I added here sold the first pop Decided that it's enough for me, so it did slowly went up. However, same thing, uh, the market can go both ways, so I'm okay with taking greens. Then it slowly grind up, and I'm okay with it. Two nice trade here. DTSS did not trade it, had some news, some IG news, crawled up, but I didn't like the action. LPTX uh, was one of the leading gappers, but as you can see, it went all the way down. It was it was around thirty percent. Seems like it. Then it came all the way back down here to fifteen. EFTR nice move. I think I traded yet. Yeah, pre market had some noise. Then there was this news like uh so I added here so the first pop. Then beside. Uh, I think I got fake out here. I was thinking maybe uh, the level two and the price movement make me felt like it wouldn't hold and you would just kiss the previous day high. This was previous day high as you can see. So I was thinking it could kiss the previous day high and came back down. However, it chose to go up. So that's why I'm thinking maybe somehow the market is pretty bullish today. It's cause of this move, it went all the way up. Same thing. Um. I'm okay with not selling here and I don't feel bad about it because back then this seems like the best reaction uh best decision and hey this is a almost a 150 move almost two bucks I'm okay with it you will see nice oh man did not see this it had a nice run up but came down pretty awful nice curl by Live, I did not see this. Uh, I was seeing, yeah, some noise first two three minutes, then basically faded. Pretty nice. Had some news too, so it would be nice if it could cross the PMH. But I'm cutting my hands, not not gonna trade anymore. So other than that, uh, and yeah, we have blue. This is awful. So in the pre-market, uh, added here. Then there's some flat top, so so long at the first flat top, and let the remaining run. It did went up here, and seeing just now, as you can see how how bullish EFTR was, so I was thinking maybe I don't need to play it so tight. That blue could provide something. So it failed here, and it failed the downtrend. I still held it, thinking. It bounce off the view up so basically just leave it and yeah it shows strength curling to the view up but 
I was thinking since it's already here, I have some cushion and I'm already green. I don't want to sell this and become red just because of a stupid ticker. So yeah, I decided to gamble it into the open. Yes, gamble. I decided to gamble it into the open. And see, it could go both ways. So actually the first minute wasn't that bad. You can see this topping tail. It, it opened here. It showed some strength. I mean, it opened here. It showed some strength. Just that it went down. So I guess you can say it blew it. Pretty bad. Really hate this. Um, I'm up 29 bucks today, and that's with this blue. I think I I sold half here, but let's say I got in around 522. I sold it at 447. Yeah, that's a 80 80 cent move. Uh, 80 cent loss with with such a such a trip stop, and I took a 80 cent loss as you can see. It's all because of this, else I might probably be up at 49. I don't know. I'm guessing. I put this in more. Oh no, I'll be up 69. Nice. I'll be up 69 bucks if not for this move. So, it really sucks. Um, 520, I like it. Down all the way to 440, 80 cent move. Yeah, so that's um. Oh yeah, that's ah oh shit. Uh, I took some ARQQ. I took some here, as you can see, and seems like it's not holding. I was thinking to play it off 50, but I guess when I was recording this, it went below 50. Unfortunate, it's tanking even more, flushing down. Um, this awful. Maybe I'll be okay. I'll probably sell this off after I'm done with the daily crap, and I'll be updating the new new PNL. So as of now, I'm up twenty nine. I think this I'll probably probably be in the red. I don't know. I just update the new PNL so. A brand new loss on ARQQ. This is a nice move today. Uh, I think I was swinging it. It has some 510k approval. Still bullish on it, so I still holding on to my swings. Other than that, nothing much. So, yeah, today, really, really nice move my ATR. And then, nice trade ET, EFTR. But, nice. Nice first trade for B blue, but I blew it. So, however, despite blowing this big chunk, what well, was supposed to be up 69, but now I'm down. I mean, now was supposed to be up 69, now I'm up 29, which is okay. But ARQQ just blew it. I'm thinking to continue holding it or just sell it. Um, since I already calculated my PNL, maybe I can consider this for the most one. So I'll see how it goes and that's all for today's daily recap. I wouldn't say I'm very very happy about the result but a green day is a green day. And then of course imagine hindsight I could sell blue here at the view up. So yeah I should really respect my gut more and not yeah I, I was I wrote this down because I was very frustrated. I overheld it. Refusing to sell when you broke the downtrend, refusing to sell when you broke the view up. This is why sometimes you should have stop stop losses. Because sometimes mentally you refuse to sell it. So I'll be happy to sell the view up here. I'll be happy to sell the broke this year. And I end up selling after a flash here. So thankfully I managed to sell it here and mount here. But yeah, this very painful. I gave back more than half my profit. Like, imagine if I did not sell here, I'm up 69 but now I'm only up 29. So that's way more than half my profit. So yeah, it hurts knowing this and I should work on my trading habits more. So I shall reflect on this trade, shoot it down on my trading journal and hopefully I'll be aware and not make such mistakes going forward. So yeah, that's all for today's daily recap. Um, really thank you guys for watching. I will appreciate 
appreciate it a lot if you could drop a comment like and also subscribe if if this is what fits your shoe so yeah that's all for today um as usual stay safe trade safe peace